Hey y'all, I'm gonna attempt to move the cows this morning. We have just been crazy busy, but it's good, all good stuff. Uh, I know y'all know we've been busy, but we didn't even get a video yesterday. We just had so much going on, we just could not make it happen. But today is another day and uh, it's gonna happen. So you can see it's super foggy this morning. I've got some cows down here. I'm hoping they'll all come. Mainly I wanna get rusty over in the hay field because I've got some cows over there that I'm not sure have gotten bred yet. And uh, I just wanna make sure that everybody gets covered as soon as possible. So let's do this. I'm gonna get a bale of hay, try to call them over there and hopefully it'll all work. These guys are happy to have some hay. Look at this one. <laughs> He's frolicking. Need a video of the other cows coming? Yep, here they come. Wait, here's the calf running again. Yep, here you go. Come on, girls. Hey, boys and girls. Come on. Hey, Jerry. Hey, girl. Come on. All right, there's some of the calves fighting and carrying on. Of course, Pepper and Jack are gonna be hateful about things. Woo, come on girls. Your bell's almost as big as Gertie, isn't she? Comes Buttercup. Everybody is all keyed up and happy this morning. Walk over and see if there's any more. Close that gate and then see if there's any more coming up the road, Josiah. Oh, three, 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 up, up the road? Oh. Oh, I see. Okay. Woo! Woo, cows. Come on, girls. Woo! Come on. Pepper's gonna run out the gate. Don't let Jack run out, Josiah. Here, hold this. <clears throat> Come on, Pepper. Stay back here, Josiah. Mm. Hey, Jerry. That's got everybody in here, and uh, which is awesome. And uh, except for, I've got one heifer still on the lower side of the property, but she's not really old enough to breed, so I, that's all. That's okay. She's in there with my steers, and uh, some of my steers, not all of them, but we are. Uh, I'm glad to get these all over here because now they can. I can be sure they all get covered and bred. Rusty will be happy. We'll be happy when we have calves and uh, they're happy to have some hay. These calves, they crack me up. They've been just absolutely nuts and wild. 
But uh, something I saw over here, I want to show y'all where I've rolled out the hay. I was saying, I think I've shared with y'all, I'm going to clean this ridge off where we pushed over with the dozer. We're going to pull all the trees down, cut them up, sell firewood this winter, and uh, feed on this ridge. And I want to show you what I'm talking about seeding. When we get back over here, I'll show you what it's looking like. It's pretty cool. All right, so what I was saying, like, where I rolled the hay down, that's how we're going to seed <clears throat> over where we've cleared all this. Which I know the trees are blocking it for y'all a little bit, but where we cleared all that <clears throat> and cleared here. We're working on rolling the hay down. Unfortunately, I've had to feed hay already this year, like 20 bales due to the drought, but uh, I think we're out of the drought now. We could still use some more rain, but things have greened up and are growing. So all this green right here is where I've rolled hay down. There was no grass. It was just brush and junk. Uh, the grass couldn't even really grow in here, but everywhere I've rolled hay down, there's new baby grass seeds. I'm gonna to attempt to show y'all. I hope you can see it, but let, let's try this. Uh, let's see here. So like right here, all this, this new baby grass that's coming in, it's just like everywhere. You can see the hay there with the new baby grass coming up. It's just, there's some areas that are thicker than others, but it's all going to sprout and just start growing grass. Here's a really nice patch. This was not new grass, this was old, but all of this right here is just new new grass coming up. <clears throat> it works so well. Like, uh, you take it here to the, to the road. One of the bales, it's hard to control where a bale's gonna go, and one of them rolled over here into the road. And this road is nothing but rock. I mean, just straight up gravel, rock, really hard junk. But even here, where the hay rolled down, there's baby grass. So that's what I wanted to show y'all. So that's what I wanted to show y'all. I thought that was pretty cool. And uh, it is a very cost-effective way to seed your, your property. Um, just, I mean, we're feeding the hay, why not use it in areas that we need to seed? And uh, it just makes the most sense to me. So it's basically you're seeding for free. All, you're, you're, you're seeding your property for free because you're feeding the hay anyway. And uh, the cows don't eat all of the hay. So some of it stays on the ground, acts just like the straw that you would put over top of your seed. So yeah, very, very, very cost-effective way to seed your property. Um, I even know of a landscaper here that buys hay from Mr. Mike to seed properties that he's clearing. He buys the round bales, rolls them out, and it works great. So anyway, there's that. The other thing we're doing today, and uh, we've had some people ask, are we going to video it? And I probably won't. If I do, it'll just be like a recap. But we are getting ready for the HOA conference, Homesteaders of America conference, not this weekend, but next weekend. So we've been working on the RV. The generator wasn't working. I want to change the oil in it, change the thermostat in it, uh, bleed the brakes, uh, figure out an air filtration system for it because there is no air filter on it right now. I'm, somebody was working on it, and I guess they lost the pieces. But it's not a big deal. All this stuff I can fix and get going. And uh, so I'm working on that. That's like priority because I don't want to run into something where I need a part and then be like next week and don't have time to get the part in if I have to order something. So we're working on that and um, also harvesting. I think Jenna's gonna harvest tomatoes today and uh, it's just been a lot going on, but it's awesome, it's exciting. It's not exhausting in a bad way, it's exhausting in a good way. You know how when you get something done, you're really tired, but you feel accomplished. It's just a great feeling. That's what it's been, <clears throat> and um, it is just really, really, really exciting. So we are just working, working, and uh, <clears throat> I think that's going to wrap up this video. We're still going to do a lot more videoing today, but uh, I think this completes this one. So y'all, if you're not subscribed to our channel, please subscribe. Please click the like button on this video. Hit the notification bell. YouTube will start notifying you every time we upload a video, and comment below. Um, <clears throat> 
let us know what you think of this video. Um, we are just digging in, and uh, we hope to hear from y'all. Thank y'all for watching. We love y'all. Have a good day.